All right, let me just dust off this vlog camera. On the road to the hockey game, I picked up the meanest, greenest, <laughs> leanest, <laughs> Grinch, <laughs> Grinch, right there. What's up, Mr. Grinch? <laughs> Look at his shirt. <laughs> yeah, the Grinch. What's you it like say? that? What's it say? Naughty. Who, me? What's up, fellas? How y'all doing? We're so, out here. So where have you been, dude? To, I know what's up, but, yeah. but fill the guys and the gals and the camera in. I had an altercation at uh, at work, and uh, I ended up losing my job over it. I'm um, going to court over the situation, so right now I can't give out everything that happened and everything, but uh, just bear with me. Once I go to court and get all my hearing and everything back, your boy would be back on it working out and and doing these vlogs and Instagrams and getting everything set. Hold on a second. So when 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 your court's over, you're gonna fill everybody in on exactly what happened because I'm the only one right now <laughs> that knows what's up. I will fill everybody in and let them know everything that has happened at my job once this court thing uh, situation is over. So to catch you up to speed, the reason why JT's been absent is because he also got hurt yes. at work. Well, this situation also got him to lose his job, which Sam's Club, thumbs down, not happy with how you handled that situation. I Hopefully, that court goes in your favor, man. Hopefully. So make sure you guys pray and wish JT good luck in court because Sam's Club, thumbs down, they handled the situation terribly. And when you guys finally hear about it, you're gonna agree. Once, like I said, once everything gets situated, you're gonna start seeing me on Instagram, posting up pictures of me running and getting everything back together. Yeah. But right now, I gotta go by what my lawyer says and keep everything on a hush hush until this fall is over with. Now you've been you've been doing the diet though, right? I've been doing the diet. So chicken knows my name. <laughs> <laughs> All those chickens, man. Rest in peace. So you've been on the diet, right? Yes. And on the diet, uh, what happened? Like, did you have any trip ups? Like, you know, because it is kind of emotional what you're going through. And I know when I get emotional, yeah. I eat. So, did you have any slip ups, or was you? I, I did have some slip ups. Uh, also, had to go over to my parents' house and and uh, help out my dad. He had a yeah. triple bypass surgery. So, Man. you already know when you're over at the family's house. You're gonna dig in and eat. Luckily, I didn't have to stay too long over there. So the last time I weighed in, I bought my dad a scale uh, a couple of weeks back, and I was at, I done moved up to 260. 260? Or 360, my bad. Oh, 360, 360. okay, yeah. yeah. So you were at 355, Yeah. So and I now gained, you're at So I gained about five, five or six pounds of that. So I'm down, I'm back to 360. That's all right. So, so, so you started off, JT started off at 400 pounds, got down to 355, and then the situation at work happened, put him on a hiatus for how many months now? Three months? Three months, man. And in three months, he stayed on the diet and only went up five pounds. So that's, that's really good, man. Yeah. That's really good. But I miss y'all out there. I do. I miss y'all. And I know I've been getting Instagram messages about where you at and what's going on. And I, I really wanted to answer y'all, but I, I got to play by the rules and, and listen to what my lawyer says. So, like I said, once I get out of this uh, out of this situation, you know, I'll keep y'all in detail about what happened and we'll be, uh, we'll be back on track. Right now we're going to a hockey game and uh, JT's going to give you an angle of how fat and slow I am on the ice right now. It's like a bunch of old men playing hockey. I told him that he has to at least score a goal. Oh yeah. I ain't going over there just to watch him not score a goal. I guarantee you I'll <laughs> score two goals, baby. And I haven't played hockey in like two, three years, so it's gonna be interesting. Hey, it's been like it's been like three years, three or four years since he's been on ice. Oh he's coming on ice. <laughs> Please take that off for me. <laughs> mm. He over here roughing out old people for. You got it,
There's one. And it's over. Six, five, four, three, two, four. Six, one. Six, two, six, one. Bruh, What's up? okay, so, so let me know. You have to pass before you shoot? Is that this what is, it uh, is? It's called D5, so it's like dads and grandpas. Okay. So they have a rule where. Once you, nobody can skate past that blue line. Right there. Come on, Okay, I see it. <laughs> so if you go past the blue line, you're not, and you have the puck not allowed to shoot, you're supposed to pass. <laughs> and there's no jumping. What? <laughs> I guess, I guess they gave a bunch of old dudes like cardiac arrest and when they got real mad at people, ringers, ringers come in. But yo, so how was it? Like, we're faster than turtles? Faster than turtles? Yeah. Yeah? <laughs> to me, to my count, you scored two goals. Bro. I know. They two goals. They gotta hold me back, got a handicap. And I got that on film. Yeah. And this is about to die, because the battery's blinking. What do you think, guys? Like hockey? I love it. It's been, that's my first time playing in three years. Yeah. That's what I was telling them. Not bad. <laughs> oh, look at that. That's how you know I've got some lady feet. I don't understand, man. I ran two tough mutters in a row, not one single blister. You got a blister. And then there's a play this one <laughs> hockey game, and I got. got a I don't wear socks with my skates, so maybe that's why. It's been a long time. I never wear socks with my really? skates. Do you guys play hockey? Do you wear socks when you're skates? Yeah, I dusted off my skates, hit the ice, and scored two goals. Asterisk. Asterisk. <laughs> One goal, and then the other goal didn't count. On my Twitter, I put the asterisk on there. You know how they have the asterisk when like a player uses sporting enhancement drugs or does something that didn't count. So it wasn't that. It was the fact that he scored a goal by an old rules. man league. An old man league. <laughs> <laughs> and and he cheered too. He did his little. I know. Oh! Oh! <laughs> I think I think in order to play in this league you have to be a dad, so that's why I'm in this league. <laughs> but yeah, it's on my Twitter. I got a little asterisk. It's pretty funny. So so we here at B Dubs and Dennis. Dennis feels so good about himself, man. He even got himself a trophy. Ah, feels good to be the champion. <laughs> Woo! What a great day! I got to play hockey. I joined the team, so I'll be playing a lot more often. And JT's back. Almost back. At least he was able to give you guys an update, which is a good sign because that means he's on his way to being back on track. So right now, I'm trying to get back on track and get caught up. I got some Live Inspired shirts and some Shock the World prank kits to give out. So I'm on the website right now about to buy some up and send them over to the winners. So if you've been expecting a package from me, no worries, it's on its way. If you want your own prank kit, your own t-shirts, check out my website, prankkits.com. Live inspired, shock the world. We'll see you next time.